Open member for Kikori, Mark Maipakai, who has been vocal on the topic of piping gas out of Gulf, put the question to Prime Minister Peter O'Neill this afternoon. Question without notice to the Prime Minister, in the <coughs> latest attempt to support the decision by Total SA and its development partners to pipe gas from El Cantilo fields in the Gulf province to Caution Bay in the central province. He wanted to know whether the PNC-led government views are different from its party member and regional member of Gulf, Avila Cavo, about having a processing plant in Central for the second LNG project. In changing your stand, Mr. Prime Minister, did you take into considera consideration the position of the regional member for Gulf being one of your own party men? And where does he stand now? Prime Minister Peter O'Neill urged the people of Gulf and the elected leaders to have the same view as the government with the aim of delivering the second LNG project. Let us work for the interest of our people there and try and find a deal that is going to benefit our people. Uh, we welcome the leaders of Gulf to be on the same table with the government while we are negotiating with Total and the partners in getting a better deal for Papua New Guineans. Prime Minister O'Neill said the operator Total has made an economical decision and the government should respect that if the project is to be delivered. Mr. Speaker, as a government it is our responsibility to try and encourage investors to come and invest in this very highly competitive sector and given that globally when we see the commodity prices particularly for oil and gas have dropped almost uh, to a record loss today to attract an investor to come and invest in those fields is very, very hard. He told the people of Gulf to be optimistic as there are other benefits like the construction of the condensate plant in Gulf and there is also the domestic market obligation to be fulfilled. Michelle Amba, National MTV News.